My name is Claude Patrick, a uh, lifelong martial artist, Canadian mixed martial arts veteran and pioneer. I fought all over the world, stateside, IFL, King of the Cage, uh, Apex, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, obviously, the biggest achievement is my time in the UFC, so I fought there, got a good record, uh, three and one in the UFC overall. I think my record is like 16 and two. Global MMA Warriors, May 30th. Uh, we got a couple guys fighting in there, Dennis Purick, um, out of uh, House of Champions and Iron Tiger Muay Thai working with him for the last couple bit. Um, he was in Thailand for a bit, he came back, so good friend of mine, a guy I'm trying to help out, get his ground game together, be as explosive as the stand-up. Yeah, you know, I'm no fortune teller, so I couldn't tell you exactly what's gonna happen. Otherwise, I'd be gambling on this thing, but not doing that. What we try to do is prepare for every situation, so training the guys, they're all workhorses. Uh, Dennis is looking really sharp now, and he's always a good fighter. Just a little bit lax in his groundwork in the past, but totally different man now, so should be a good show. Developmentally, there's not really a lot of opportunities in Ontario for whatever reason for some of the, the younger athletes. You know, there was a time when there was a show every week. Every month there was at least a show. Now we're looking at a period of time where there's only one show and that Global War is right now. So that's where everybody's got to put their eggs in that basket, irregardless of what your, you know, your vested interests are. If you're in the mixed martial arts game, if you've got a gym and you're advertising MMA, you've got to be there. You've got to sell tickets, keep the ball rolling so the guys can compete. Otherwise, we're going to turn into like another ninja craze. Just poof, you know, disappear, and <laughs> all the MMA will be gone. So we're lucky that uh, these guys, Garnett and them, put on this show and uh, gave us a venue to show off the wares. Some good fighters in the card, even outside of our crew, though. Like, Ontario's got some good fighters, good athletes, um, and these guys are making their return to the province, so it's going to be good overall.